Mohammed, good day. Good day, sir. Good day. How are you today? Yeah, fine. Excellent. Revitalize. Re revitalize. Yes. So this is the new word. Yeah. So revitalize is if you want to make something healthier. So let's say you have been working very hard for a whole week okay. for like 20 hours every day. Mm -hmm. Then you need to take like two days off mm -hmm. to revitalize. It's like to charge your batteries of your body, to um, eat healthy food, to get your body back into a, let's say, a very productive state so that you feel energetic again. So revit uh, revitalize. Re yes. Revitalize. 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 So you can say, yeah. Say, so I need some revitalizing because I've been working too hard. Means uh, revitalize, I need some rest or I need to do work hard? Uh, I need to rest. I need some rest. Rest, good food, um, just to like go to the beach mm -hmm. and in like don't have any work. Mm -hmm. So it's to recharge your batteries in your body. Okay, revitalize, revitalize, yeah. revitalize. Yeah. Okay. Revitalize. Okay. So uh, what is the synonym of for that? Sino revitalize, revitalize means synonym of revit uh, revitalize. It a synonym would be to recharge. Recharge. Yeah, I need to like revitalize my battery on my phone. Okay. I need to recharge my battery. Oh, that is okay. I need okay. to re revitalize my battery. I I need to revitalize. I revitalize myself. Correct. Yes. Revitalize. Yeah, you want to go from a bad state to a good state. Good state. From you... no energy to lots of energy. Lots of energy. Okay, that is yeah. fine. Good. The next word is conservative. 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 Okay. Yeah. Okay. Mm. So conservative means somebody that is very traditional in their values. Traditional in their values. In their values. Like, for example, my mom and dad are very conservative. Mm. They don't speak about social media. They um, go to church every Sunday. They don't do anything different. They are very conservative. They are if very you conservative. speak to them, mm -hmm. if you speak to them, they won't offer their opinion. They will listen, but they will never like. Or most cases, they don't offer their opinion because they keep to themselves. They conservative. They are believing in all kind of culture. The old type of thinking. There is no yeah. conservative type. Means we can say that conservative. Their thinking is con conservative. Yeah, the thinking is conservative. Mm. Yes. Okay. The next one is superstition. Hmm? Superstition. Superstition. Superstition means to our superstition knowledge. You should have superstition knowledge. Means upper, no. upper knowledge. No. Superstition, for example, some people have a superstition before they watch a sport. So maybe their superstition is when you're watching sport, don't leave the TV. Because if you leave, something bad is going to happen. Superstition, uh huh. Yeah, so it's to believe something. Mm -hmm. That might happen. That maybe won't happen. So okay. Like, so, okay. So yeah. if, if you like, uh, means you have superstition means. Yeah, uh, if you are not doing this thing, something will happen. Yes, it's to it's to believe in something. Mm. Um, like for example, some people have a superstition that never walk under a ladder. Because if you walk under a ladder, you'll have five years of bad luck. Ladder. Under the ladder means? 
a, a ladder. Let's say you want to paint three meters, a three meter high wall. Mm. You need a ladder to climb up to yes, paint. Yes, yes, yes. Then you climb down the ladder. Some people believe that if you've got a ladder, that's an A-frame ladder. Mm -hmm. Never walk under the ladder. Oh, 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 oh. Yeah. Or some people believe, believe never break a mirror. Mm -hmm. If the, you have a mirror, yes, yes. No. Never break the mirror because that will bring you bad luck. So this is called, sometimes people are like be believing in this kind of superstition. Like uh, the, uh, when uh, when ca when we are going, the cat is going on the way. There we go. Yes. <laughs> so so don't cross. if yeah. yeah, if a cat runs in front of you, yes, normally a black cat. Uh -huh. Yeah, if a black cat runs across the road, then you must turn around. You must go the other way. Yeah, yes, yes. That's a superstition. Yeah. The next one is a prank. Prank, prank, yeah, prank. Prank is prank. Na is nothing but like prank joke. Excellent. Good, yeah. To tell a joke or to have a trick. That's a trick, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The next word is retrench. Which one? Retrench. Retrench. Yes. Retrench. Okay. Retrench. Okay. So, if you've been working for a company, mm -hmm. and the company tells you to please leave, mm. they retrench you. It's like it's not getting fired. It's not for doing something wrong. It's the company doesn't have the money to pay you anymore. Like a lot of people got retrenched when there was coronavirus. So company is go not going to pay something. Your company can't afford you anymore. So this is called retrench. They retrench you. So they will give you a letter to say, Muhammad, mm -hmm. thank you for your work. Mm -hmm. But you don't work at our company anymore. Bye-bye. Okay. Okay. So it's like, for example, let's say Google hmm. has, I don't know, no, I'll use, use a better example. Um, Virgin Atlantic is the airline that flies. I don't know if you've heard of the guy called Richard Branson. Richard Branson owns Virgin Cola, Virgin Records, Virgin Galactic, Virgin um, Airlines. So he's the owner of the Virgin Group. Okay. But during the coronavirus, the airplanes weren't flying anymore. Hmm. So people that were working for him, he had to retrench. He had to say to them, listen, guys. I can't pay you. There's no money coming in. I want to keep you, but financially, I can't afford you. Mm. So I need to retrench you. I need to dismiss you from your duty. Okay, okay. 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 Then the opposite of retrench is to resign. Resign. Yeah. Okay. So, resign is when you don't want to work for the company anymore. Then you tell the company, I don't want to work here. You say to your manager, dear Mr. Manager, thank you for the past two years of work, but I'm not going to work here anymore. Like if you get another, let's say you work at Coca-Cola, mm -hmm. but then Amazon wants you to come and work for them. Now you need to say goodbye to Coca-Cola. You need to resign. Yeah. 